Hello and welcome back to the Jim Green Footwear channel. For the past few weeks we've been breaking down a custom boot of the week going spec by spec and dissecting the boot before having a look at how the boots is made. This week we're doing a little bit different and we're having a look at the custom boot rack of the week. What this means is that we are not looking at a singular boot of the week, instead we have taken a selection of custom boots that have come through the factory and we're going to have a brief look at what these customers have chosen to change on their boots or keep the same from the stock options. Our first pair off the rack is heading off to Castle Rock in Colorado and is a Shuli in our fudge leather spec, which is more commonly found on our African Ranger. Further upper changes to this custom spec see the removal of the toe puff, giving an unstructured toe, the removal of the steel shank and white stitching with the green lace to top it all off. This is a sleek, soft and versatile option for this customer's wardrobe. Next is the newcomer to the range, the Numzan boot in our tobacco suede finish. This custom pair is heading off to Utopia, Texas. This custom spec sees the changes in the leather choice, moving from our stock veg tan options found on the Numzan boot to a suede option. Moving further down the boots to the sole choice, which is now a Naringo sole. Finally, there is an addition of a pull loop on the back of this boot allowing for easy application and removal of this customer's boots. Our next boot and a popular choice of this week's rack features an African Ranger in a steel toe cap with a rough out African Buffalo leather finish. An important note with this spec is that it is also double lasted, meaning there are two layers of leather. So instantly we know with the steel toe cap and double lasted option this boot is designed for some seriously hard work and mileage in mind. This pair is heading off to Brooklyn, New York and we look forward to hearing the stories to come from the concrete jungle ahead. Another African Ranger on the custom rack this week and it's heading off to Layton, Utah. This custom spec features our new Houston green leather which is the exact same spec as our fudge leather, a oily new buck characteristic and finish. Where this spec gets interesting is in the sole, where the customer has opted for the mini lug and EVA combination and the removal of the toe puff giving it an unstructured toe and focused on comfort. Our next feature is an AR8 steel toe cap with buffalo and rough out buffalo upper specs. This custom boot is a great example of how the exact same leather can differ by simply flipping the material for a rough out texture and finish. Apart from the unique combination of the upper, this customer has chosen our new frog grip sole, giving the side profile of the boot a slightly more sleek stepped finish, but still ready to kick rocks with the rough out upper. Another spec change comes in the eyelid composition seeing the addition of more hooks to the spec for easy removal and application of the boot in the field. This pair is off to Portland, Oregon. Final feature from this week's custom boot rack has us looking at the Boabab boot and once again our rough out buffalo leather finish with a Jim Green lug sole. Straight away we can assume this boot is designed for some hard miles. The rough out finish will do a great job at handling the wear and tear to come and paired with the JG lug sole, there will be many adventures and miles before a resole is needed for this pair. Along with these specs, the customer has also gone for the addition of a composite toe cap, giving some extra protection and support around the toe area as they kick along the trails ahead. Wrapping up our custom rack of the week, we hope this video has given you an insight as to what you can achieve with our custom boot builder and hopefully some inspiration for your next pair of custom Jim Green boots. So thank you for watching the video, don't forget to like, subscribe and enjoy the Jim Green journey ahead.